Harry turn red. Royal Guard exposes his setup eavesdropper at Buckingham Palace while Senior is busy at coronation. After making a brief appearance at the coronation, Harry was said to have been at Buckingham Palace to avoid scrutiny, but when the opportunity came, he secretly set up a wiretap in the palace to record audio for the royal family, movie on Netflix. However, this was discovered and reported by the royal bodyguards. How bad is Prince Harry's relationship with his family of origin? Well, bad enough that despite making a quick stop at Buckingham Palace to gather himself while en route from Westminster Abbey to Heathrow Airport after the coronation, he did not wait around to see or speak to any members of his family. The fleeting visit lasted less than half an hour and took place while his family was still on parade, participating in the coronation procession from the Abbey to the Palace. The Telegraph said to pit stop, and that was for logical reasons, and allowed Harry to take a moment out of the public gaze following the two-hour Abbey service, but said he did not see or speak to any of his family. Bizarrely, Harry did not even take the opportunity to change while at the palace, instead wearing his morning suit and medals into the VIP suite at Heathrow for his return flight, a gesture that seemed to many to symbolize his desperation to flee the UK. Earlier that day, a professional lip reader interpreted him as saying, I'm fed up with the way they treat me, to Princess Eugenie's husband, Jack Brooksbank. He was also seen saying, a quarter to four was when his flight home would be. Sources emphasized that the lack of contact with Harry during his brief palace layover was inevitable for practical reasons, with Harry racing to return to his wife and children in America. However, the report will be seen as confirmation of the extreme tension between Harry and his family. He has not seen his family privately in the flesh since the publication of his memoir, Spare, which excoriated Prince William and King Charles and was not invited to appear on the balcony with other family members. Friends of William have told the Daily Beast that he hates his brother for what he sees as betraying him by publicly revealing his secrets. Harry spent less than 30 hours in the UK during his visit. He landed back in Los Angeles on Saturday evening and is said to have rushed home to Montecito to say goodnight to Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet. Meghan Markle did not attend King Charles' coronation over the weekend, but her absence has spoken and was spoken about by royals on the big day. The Duchess of Sussex was invited to attend the historic event on Saturday, but stayed at home in California to celebrate her son, Prince Archie's fourth birthday. Even though Archie and Sister Lilibet are the grandchildren of the new king, it is believed that they were not invited because they were too young. A lip reader picked up on the moment where the Duke of Sussex is believed to have spoken about his wife, the Jack, as they waited for Charles to arrive, writes the Mirror. Speaking to the Daily Star, the expert suggested Harry replied to an unknown question from Jack, which was referring to Meghan, saying, no, she's at home. 